Alright, it's working now. So how many times have you been <laughs> you to this place? Lanyards can come over here. Okay, in 2008, 139 times. 2009, 139 times. I'm perfect this year. I've been to Soak City last year 102 times. I'm per missed one day this year. Which is the best ride out there? Which park? There's Any one. park. Drag store with a rollback. Can't beat it because it doesn't happen to everybody. There's the most exclusive club is the stuck on top of the drag store club. Very stuck on top? Yes. Has that ever happened to you? No, I wish it did. No. What's a rowback? A rowback is when the dragster does not make it over the top and comes down backwards. Best ride in the park. And have you have you done that before? Twenty five times, two thousand and nine, two times this year so far. No, I mean a rowback. Have you how many yeah. times? Twenty five times. Twenty five times rowback. Two thousand and nine. Usually happens when the it's rainy out and the track is a little bit wet. Is there anyone that knows more about these rides than yourself? Many people. There are coastal really? freaks all over the place. Some yeah. of them wear these t shirts on them will come up to you, they'll start telling you who made the coaster, when they made it. I call them the CIA, Coaster Intelligence Agency. They've actually been known to follow trucks of coaster parts and watch where which way they head off so they can tell which where it's headed for. Now is there any competition between you guys? A friendly competition or is it is it mostly just bragging about how many number of rides on no X coaster and whatever coaster. I don't do it because there's no way to keep track. Right. Word of honesty. With this, they keep track of it in the computer. Wednesday, I'll hit 200 times here. Yeah. So what else? What else can you say about yourself? I did the most stupid thing ever. I drove to Kings Island one day, turned around, drove 205 miles from the parking lot of Kings Island all the way to the parking lot of Cedar Point. Then I rode the uh, Millennium Force, Dragster, Maverick, and Top Throw Paddleboard, all in one day. So what, what is, your, what is your, you're kind of like a roller coaster, that's your job, your full-time job as a roller coaster fan? No, I'm a roller coaster freak, geek. I wrote a thing on the web, uh, 141 signs are roller coaster geek. There it is. And what's your name? Chris Galati. Chris Galati. What's your website? ChrisGalati.com. All right. What can we help to find there? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> That's my website and how to spell my All right. Let's get a good look at that. Just keep it. Don't worry about it. I'm amazing. You have nothing to fear. I'm a nutcase. I've been over to Iraq. The craziest thing I ever did is when I came back in 2004, I asked at the gate, which day does when does Cedar Point open? When they said today, I looked at my wife, who I hadn't seen in a year, and told her, honey, I love you, I'm going to Cedar Point. And nope, she did not kill me. Where do you live? Five miles away. Oh. Of course, right? Yeah. Would you live anywhere else? Uh, I looked at the cost of renting the breakers for a year, and it cost $8,000, $80,000. That would be closer. Uh, yeah, in the park. Yeah. Bingo Rider! Look at all this. Look how ridiculous this is.